Hey, Brian Fouch here with Living Legacy. And a question I've been asking myself for years now, once I started to gain better financial literacy was, am I gaining assets or am I gaining liabilities? Or another better way to look at it is, where's my money going? Is my money going towards liabilities or is it going towards assets? And once I started to understand this concept and I started looking at different people, investors and business owners, uh, W-2 employees, I started to realize that a lot of the people that um, I wanted to learn from, uh, people that became my mentors later on in, in years later, was that they focused on their money going out and acquiring assets. So as an example, like I used to go out and acquire a car, a car loan, uh, you know, uh, credit cards. Those are liabilities to me. But here's the thing for the, the, the bank or for the credit union or the car company, that's a, an asset, right? Because that is paying them income. And yet I've got this car that is actually sucking away my money. My money is going towards a liability. And so one of the things that I look at now is that when I go to acquire something or I want to buy something or use money or place money, my question to myself is, is I, am I acquiring an asset? Am I acquiring a liability when I do this? Because if I'm acquiring more liabilities than I am assets, I'm going in the negative direction for, for me. And so I always want to go in that positive direction. And when I have been mentored by some very successful business owners, one of the things that they do with their money is they want to make sure their money is placed somewhere first, somewhere first that makes it an asset for them or it turns that money into uh, more of an asset or requires an asset for that individual. That's the first thing they want to do with their money. And so it's a very different way of looking at it. So uh, think about what your, ne your next big purchase. Is that big purchase going to be an asset for you or, an, or a liability? If you're going to get a loan, is that loan a liability for you or an asset for somebody else? Who are you making wealthy? Is it you or somebody else? And so this is a topic that I love to talk about because it's very interesting how certain individuals who understand how money flows and how cash flow works, they really understand that it's very important where your money goes first. Where it goes first is almost more important than where it goes, you know, later on down the road. So um, to learn more, hit, you know, hit the follow or uh, go to brianfoss.com, learn more. I'm going to be putting some more courses and things inside there to talk about more about these kinds of concepts. So with that, take care. Talk to you soon.